Yo, what is up YouTube? I am your host Benny and welcome back to JXG channel where we covered all the sneaker related content and bring it to your screen. So first of all, I would like to say thank you to all of your love and support. We have finally reached a thousand subscribers and that is insane guys. So honestly, I have been on YouTube for six years and I have never taken it seriously until this past 12 months. And I have been trying so hard to reach a thousand subscribers and because of all of you guys, we reached that goal. Joining the JXT family and I hope that the community that we are building here will grow into something meaningful. And now let's talk about the sneaker that we are going to look at today and as you guys can see this is something new to the channel we have never reviewed an Air Jordan 2 before and honestly I have never owned a pair of Air Jordan 2 except the Just Dawn 2 in the blue colorway this is my second pair of Jordan 2 I am not familiar with this model at all however I have a good experience with my first pair and this shoe is also looking really nice in hands so we'll deep dive into how the shoe look all of the features all of the materials and some secret features that came with the shoe as well yeah so without further ado let's take a look at this nike air jordan 2 j balvin in celestine blue colorway So as usual, let's take a look at the box of the sneaker itself. And as you guys can see, there's a nod to the original 1987 Air Jordan 2 box. So what we have here is this cartoonish brain with this two green lightning bolt on the top of the lid. J Balvin designed this cartoonish brain to bleed through the side of the lid. And that is created the silhouette of the Wings logo, which features in the original Air Jordan 2 box. This is a really nice touch. Moving on to the side, we have this Air Jordan logo written on the side of the box and moving on to the box level and we have Air Jordan 2 Retro SP Celestine Blue White and Multicolor Now let's get into the sneaker itself and as you guys can see this shoe is astounding. It is really nice. The material on this is unique and really interesting. So let's dive in. So first of all as you guys can see we have this really nice Celestine Blue suede upper going around the toe box and the toe cap and the same short hair suede material also apply on the heel tab of the sneakers which have white Nike logo printed on. On the side panel we also have this really nice cordura fabrics seems to be waterproof. It feels really rugged and really sturdy so I think this is a really nice touch to add to the shoe. The same material also apply on the ankle collar as well. And on the heel of the sneakers we have this matte plastic reinforcement to provide more stability to the sneaker itself. And behind that translucent plastic piece we have this blue sky with the J Balvin smiley face logo in the back of the heel. If we take a closer look at the sneaker itself, we can see that all of the stitches on the upper are in this rainbow gradient and that is really nice. Adding a pop of multicolor into a monochromatic shoe is a really nice welcoming touch. On the eyelets, we have a mix between white metal eyelets and this blue translucent eyelets on the middle portion of the shoe. And talking about laces option that came with the shoes, the shoe came in these white laces and have two more options of Celestine blue laces and these teal green laces as well. I think the teal green is a nice touch. The Celestine blue will make the shoe look kind of dull, but the white is definitely the best look in my opinion. And now moving on to the tongue, we have the Celestine Blue Suede Tongue. Really nice touch and have a classic Wings logo in the middle. These Wings logo have some functionality to it. First of all, it is glow in the dark. So if you're under the sunlight and you walk into the shade, this Wings logo will glow by itself. And the second function of this Wings logo is this thing light up. If we press 
the lightning bolt sign in the back of the tongue. One time it is going to light up just like this. But now there's another feature. If we hit it another time, the wings logo turned into pulse mode. It is really cool to see. It is a subtle flex. Honestly, in the dark, having this pausing rhythm on your shoes, nice touch. And hit it another time to just turn it off. And now moving on to the bottom portion of the shoe, we have this white foam midsole and we have this semi-translucent blue outsole. And this thing can glow in the dark as well as the tongue. So if you're planning to go to the party, wearing this shoe will make you really stand out from the crowd. So that is pretty much it, man. That is everything you need to know about this shoe, all the material features and all that. What I feel about this collaboration is something that going beyond just putting two names into one shoes. They did a really good job executing this collaboration from the packaging to the sneaker itself. This Jordan 2 collaboration showing so much of the personality and art direction that J Balvin is going after from various collaboration in various brand that he did. This shoe fit right into those lineup and I think this is such a really good shoe that doesn't even have to be on feet. This is such a good display piece by itself and on feet it looks really stunning as well. So without further ado, let me show you guys how this shoe look on feet. Let's go.
all right guys and that is pretty much it for this review if you guys like what you see here today please tell your friend tell your family show them this video and hopefully spreading the word making our family grow bigger that will help the channel out a lot the love that you guys showed me this past year is incredible i would like to say thank you again to all of you who actually stay until the end you guys are the real mvp of this channel and i hope to see you guys in the next video peace out guys <laughs>